attention and move on. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but, you know, we want to we wanna make it the bullshit as realistic as possible. That was the entire, entire goal. Okay. All right, so we've gone through the, through the two rounds of uh, individual bullshit stuff. Now we're going to we're so excited. <laughs> so now we're going to go to the questions from uh, the audience. Remember to raise your hands, and if you do more of a comment, less of a question. John, John can I ask a question? No. What are the words the questions begin with? Uh, who, what, where, why, and how, generally speaking. What about, when? What about so? Is so a question? <laughs> <laughs> so. So. <laughs> <laughs> yes, start with you. What fictional subgenre do you see being the next new hot trend? <laughs> a subgenre in fiction or a fictional? <laughs> because I have a gypsy funk folk fan. <laughs> We've been, we've been putting a lot of hours into the studio. Um, How's that been going? I know that you've been having a, a, a few problems with that. Well, I've got nothing but free time. Right. You know? <laughs> <laughs> so, I just, I just you heard away with my music, you know? I'm doing all the instruments. Right. <laughs> is, this that, is this that new album, Roma, If You Want To? <laughs> <laughs> oh, <wow. laughs> This starts a question. That's a question. The deep cut is the firstest. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I feel like the I feel like the advent of um, like cyborg <coughs> raccoon vigilantes <laughs> in film has caused me to want to read more about cyborg raccoon vigilantes, how they came to be, how many of them. Uh, there are, and if you can make a cyborg vigilante out of all forest creatures. So, and I feel like other people share my interest. I remember you and I were talking about this last night, that not only are you interested in reading it, but you've actually um, started the rock opera. Right. Well, it came out of my fanfic. Yeah. Um, <laughs> and now I'm working on, yeah, the music form. Yeah. How's that going for you? Well, I'm actually having Jonathan Colton do most of the music. <laughs> um, kind of like our Christmas album. <laughs> sort of sit there and every once in a while I'll throw some tinsel at him. <laughs> and you, Mr. Man? I'm just going to do what uh, John does, but make it erotic. Because <laughs> <laughs> raccoons. There we go. All right, next question. Right here. Can you expound on the dangers of metal screen doors? Oh, shit, man. <laughs> <laughs> How much time do you want? <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, but I can, buddy. Yeah. But no, I mean, as you know, or maybe you don't, you know, I've, I'm national spokesperson for Metal Door Awareness Day, which is uh, every August 3rd. Um, and, uh, you know, I have that a personal story. Uh, with that, I was five years old, you know, and I was trapped at a, a Metal Door convention. And, uh, you know, I was lost. and. And I was, I, 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 I was separated from my parents for, like, days. I only existed on the candy in the bowls, from the hospitality bowls. And, uh, I know, I know. And ever since then, I've felt the need to let people know, Metal Door, they'll fucking kill you, man. <laughs> Give them a chance. And that's why I awareness of screen doors that are made out of wood, out of polycarbon, uh, our carbon fiber, which is the newest and, and best technology. Do you think that the, the FDA would be able to get in there? You would think, you know, but it, you know, the, the you know, it is it's old screen door money. Right, it is the old screen door money. <laughs> you know, they, they've been the old screen door boy network. They, 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 they've been doing it for, for years. There is a revolving screen door of money. That goes in and out. Oh. Oh. Wow. Prove me wrong. That was, that was a groan of sympathy. Uh, my, my primary problem with metal screen doors is that uh, I'm under constant police surveillance, and the uh, microwaves they use to uh, tap my phones will actually heat up my screen doors, right. so that I'm constantly getting a waffle burn pattern on my hands. It's really criminal. Well, you know, I, I have the exact opposite problem. I live up in Wisconsin, right, and uh, you know, it's cold, real cold, especially these last couple of winters. 
and uh, the other Thanks, Obama. And, <laughs> and so, uh, you know, I hear you, yes, guy, you're knocking, and they never just, like, leave it. They never wait. And so I'm in the shower, right, and I rush out, and I'm trying to catch him, but, you know, the whole... This is my fanfic to the letter. <laughs> Christmas story, you'd stick your tongue to the pump handle. Yeah. <laughs> Metal screen door. Um, I mean, fresh out of the shower, and I'm running. And uh, yeah. It's all I can do not to touch myself right now. <laughs> have, have your fingerprints. <laughs> no, actually, that's the one upside is the lack of fingerprints now. Right. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, you know, uh, it, that's a good thing for your uh, professional assassin. Oh. <laughs> Spoiler alert. <laughs>